Yahya, I got a mistake. Now you're right, I did a mistake. But does that mistake reach a level of me leaving the Sunnah, being a Mubtadi' now? No. But you know what it is? You have no justice, you're not fair. You're going against the ayah, وَلَا يَجْرِ مَنْ لَكُمْ شَنَآنُ قَوْمٍ عَلَىٰ أَنْ لَا تَعْدِلُوا إِعْدِلُوا وَأَقْرَبُوا لِلتَّقْوَىٰ وَاتَّقُوا اللَّهِ إِنَّ اللَّهَ خَبِيرٌ بِمَا تَعْمَلُونَ To be just is missing from you. And fairness is missing from you. You had grudge against me in the first place. And so now you found a mistake and you're going to make that mistake bigger than what it really is. Well, some people are like, as Ibn al-Qayyim said, they like flies. They, they like the fly. Where does the fly land on? It will land on wounds and dirty and filthy places. You know, your body parts, if you've got a wound on somewhere, you've got pus coming out of your body parts and it's just ripped or you slipped and it's bled and it's become a bit. The fly won't go to any part of your body other than there. It will land on that part of your body. That's where it will land. You see? And uh, some people are like that, Ibn al-Qayyim said. They are like that. They only want the eat, they only, that's all they want. And if the person does one mistake, what they want to do is they want to bring about a thousand reasons and explanation and other points. They just want to add on to it. And it's only just one mistake. And they leave off the person's ocean of good. And in that case, the ulama, Ahlul Sunnah, Ibn Abdul Barra, and Subki, and others, Ibn Qayyim as well, they all said, Man thabatat adalatuhu. Anybody whose integrity and his nobility has been established. Oh yes, it's clear now this person is noble. Tabatat adalatuhu. He's become known to be a righteous individual. Or she's become known to be a woman of high integrity. She's known. Tabatat adalatu. And it has become clear to the people. It is lam yajuz. It is not permissible to remove that certainty with doubt. Or with speculation. You can't remove that clear cut certainty. Which everybody was certain that this person was noble. The ummah are speaking good about him. In terms of his religion. His practicing. It is not permissible for somebody to come and to now remove the certainty that's there based on a doubt, speculation, assumptions. Maybe, that's what he meant. Maybe, just... Nah. Ahlul Sunnah are like that. Ibn Taymiyyah says in another place, in his Majmu'u al-Fatawa, he says, Ahlul Sunnah wal ilm the people of the Sunnah, the people who have true knowledge. Wal-Iman, the people who have true faith. Ya'lamuna al They know the truth. Pay attention. Mm -hmm. One of the distinct characteristics of Ahlul Sunnah wal Jama'ah, my beloved brothers and sisters, is what? That they are known for is that they know the truth. They are people of knowledge. They know the Kitab and they know the Sunnah. يعلمون الحق, they know the truth. ويرحمون الخلق, and they're very merciful to the creation. Ahlul Sunnah wal Jama'ah are known for two noble characteristics. العلم والرحمة, knowledge. And they're very merciful to the creation. These are two distinct characteristics that should be yours. That you should be known for brothers and sisters. 